Hello everybody, my name is Shannon and I am a digital marketing and e-commerce specialist and today I am going to show you how to add some pages into your Square website. So first you're going to start out in the Square editor. Excuse my screen going all over the place. And when you start out in the Square editor, what you're going to do is this is what it's going to look like and you see up here where it says page home. This is the home for all of the pages that you have. So for my current website, you can see I have home, I have about, and I have services. So say if I wanted to list a page that's called contact me, or if I wanted to list a page that had any information about me, what I would do is I would click here, add a page. So you click add page, it will bring you to this. This is this series of different pages that you can add. But for the purposes of this video, I'm going to add a, uh, a blank page because it'll start with no sections. So if you wanted a contact page, it would go here and essentially it would just take you to a form um, where you can tailor all of the information for your brand. But what we're going to do is add a blank page. So I'm going to hit blank page. So say I want to make an about us page. I'd enter about us, add page to navigation. So you select this if you want the page to go right up to the top navigation bar. If you don't and you want to do it manually, we'll do that later. Um, but for the sake of this video and for what I want, I want my about page to be up here in the navigation bar. So I'd hit add. So what this is going to do is it's going to give you a blank page. And I don't freak out. It says pick a, se a section to add contact content here. So what you want to do obviously is add a section. So the section that you add varies based on what kind of a page you want to make. So for me, I'm making an about us page. What I want to do is I want to add text and image. So I'm going to click text and image. And as you can see, they have a variety of different types of templates that you can use. And because this is an about us page, what I want to do is I, I think I want to have the image up here and the text below it. So we're going to go here. Looks good to me. Hit add. So make sure you hit add or else you're not going to be able to make any modifications to it. So what we can do now, so you see group, distinctive, and bold. Distinctive and bold is the default for the text that is down here. So say I want to add the picture in first, so I'm going to click on the picture right here. And under content, go to image, add image. So let's say I want to add a picture of a computer. I'm going to go to free photos because I don't have any images of a free, of a computer. I'm going to type computer. This looks fine. So I'll use that, hit save. That photo is automatically going to go there. And what I want to do is type in here. So about, about the owner. And essentially you'll just make any changes you want. And here, We'll type in a description. So Shannon is a <laughs> communications, digital marketing, and e-commerce specialist. Sounds good to me. And then for this, you can have this button here. If you don't want to have it because it's an about us page, you don't have to. So for because it's an about us page, I don't really want a button. So I'm just going to take that away. See so here you have that. Say you're not too happy with just having the image and the text. Hmm, what are we going to do now? So what we can do is we can hit the back and hit done because we're done with putting our description and our about us here. But we think we want to have a banner on our about us page. So what we're going to do is we're going to hit main banner and you can see that's turned off. We're going to turn that on. Beautiful. And because it's an about us page, we'll put about us up here. We don't really need a shop now button because you know, they're not shopping off the About Us page. But if you want to have a background on this About Us right here on this banner, it's similar to what we went over in my last video, which goes over how to add photos and make edits to your banner. I'm going to go banner image, add banner, or sorry, add image, and say I want a black background. Actually, no, let's do a white background because we got to think. Keep in mind the theme of your website and what you have. Let's just go with this random one. 
and there we go about us and then you go down and it's got all of that information so that is how to add a page now because I don't want this page say you get in the position where you don't want to have a page and you want to delete a page you get here delete page see this gear right here delete page say you want to make this the same page or you want to make it your home page you can do it from here but for the sake of this we're completely done not happy with this or it's just not serving your purpose you're going to delete that page confirm delete so that is the process of creating a page on square so just to recap what you're going to do is when you get into the home editor you see up here it says page home you are currently editing the home page but because you want to edit or create a different page you hit that drop down and you go you can go here and edit any of the pages that you currently have see this is my services page oh and again i have that image and you just go down this is what i've created and you can add a, add a link to book or to buy or anything like that but this is the home for all of your pages Alrighty, well I hope this helped, if this video helped, please like and subscribe to my channel for more content like this, and if you need any assistance with anything, you have any questions, just comment down below, I'd be happy to help out. Alrighty, have a great day.